there have been a lot of Shimano cranks failing lately, and uh, they can fail rather catastrophically. Doesn't really happen on 105 and a lot of the other cranks like this DXR. It's not bonded together at all. It's really only happening in the Dura Ace and Ultegra cranks, like especially the R8000 cranks. And uh, if your bike is creaking and you have one of these crank sets, Okay, it is, it's imperative that if it's creaking, you need to address it, and at the very least, you need to inspect the crank to make sure that it is not cracking. Now, I, was, I like to use the method of just tapping on it, and I can hear there's a big difference between that one, which is delaminated, and this one that's not. See how that's that high-pitched ring? Not everybody, uh, that doesn't work for everybody. So uh, what you really want to look for is around where these bonded edges are, you want to look for cracks, stress cracks that might be starting. Because if this has come unbonded at all, if it's bonded well over here and unbonded over here, it could open up a stress crack in between them. If you're having a creaking issue, this is one of the things you need to look at. And, uh, and if you don't inspect it for a long time, it could start opening that big crack. And next thing you know, like a big chunk of this crank is hanging off the end of your shoe and you're trying to ride down the road.